Well, Mark, was that as bad as it pretty much has been this season? It's been as bad as probably it's been for a good few years, but um, you know, even the Stoke game where we lost 4-0 last year, it, it was worse than that, I think. Sometimes the, the game gets away from you early in the game, you know. Today was that. We got a big conceded after a minute uh, with a really poor goal. Um, we've got to defend that better. And you, look, we can concede goals from, from, from anywhere. You can, can concede goals from corners or, um, you know, you don't always get it your own way. Mm. And they set the stall out from the first minute and we didn't cope with it. So we, we've been old manned. You know they've had they've got an experienced lineup, and they have run harder than us. They have fought harder than us, but they've they've done um, the dirty side of the game better than anybody that's been here. So you know they, they deserve to win. There's no doubt about it. But it, it's just the manner of the defeat. You know I mean, it's all right. We talk about the clean sheet in the second half, but it, it's done. The game's finished. It's over and done with. And and then really you're just looking at trying to salvage something and it's not even pride because there's no there's no pride in that. It just didn't even look like a, a performance, it looked like a group of individuals that were scared stiff and and let them go on top of us physically and mentally and, and that's what cost us the game. There were some poor individual performances and poor individual decisions but you know, you've got to look at that and um, it's even difficult to pick the bones out of that one because it was just so poor. So we, we've just got to get on with it and and, uh, and get ready because we've got we've got a game on Monday coming and we can't feel sorry for ourselves. We've got to be ready to go. Yeah. You only made the one change at half time, but were you sort of weighing up options to, to maybe make more changes given the the way the first half panned out? <laughs> yeah, but again, you, you know, uh, it, it's difficult to make those changes when I'm sort of a little I'm a little bit hamstrung at the minute with injuries that we've got and also Torpy was okay thankfully but he couldn't play a full game. If I played him from the start today he wouldn't have been able to be involved in next week. So and the chances are that that, that he would have he would have done his uh, he would have done his calf properly. So th th there's, there's those things that I've got to weigh up, um, which isn't ideal but you know that isn't the reason for the, the defeat. The manner of the defeat was was just atrocious. You know, we've got to stand up and you've got to fight. First and foremost you've got to earn that right and we didn't we didn't do anything like that so we deserve what we got which was absolutely nothing and they're doing. We got a proper doing. So yeah, there's a bit to do. But fortunately for us there's a game on Monday and it's against a really difficult side. You know, they're on the crest of a wave and um, and we've got to turn our attention to that and, and make sure that we do not slip up in that game. Um, like I said, we can you can lick your wounds but you know, at the end of the day, you've got to take this and, and take it on the chin and take all the criticism that you're going to get and stick your chest out and go and put in another performance on Monday that's worthy of the shirt. Well, Louis, it was painful to watch, to be honest. Uh, was it painful to play in? Yeah, you can't really hide the fact everyone saw we weren't at it today. Um, we didn't start well enough. They were, they looked like they're an experienced side and we made them look like that. They. They were more. They were first to every ball. Um, yeah, and there's no hiding from the fact that we weren't at it. Um, it's tough to do this because what do you say? Like mm. everyone knows, everyone saw it. So yeah, we just weren't. Why not our? Why not? Why not our level? No, it was the worst possible start. Mm. Conceding after a, well within the first minute. Yeah, once once you do that, you can either go under or come back from it. And we went under. Like like I said before, you can't. Everyone saw it. There's not much to say. Mm. Second goal, it looked as though the danger was over, but kind of one of those where you, ha you you've got the chance to clear it. But yeah. um, I guess credit to Preston, they put the press on you all the way through the game, didn't they? Yeah, they come with a press. It was difficult to play out, but we got to, we can't just use that as an excuse. We got to find a way. Like you say, we had a chance to clear it, but when we didn't, and then again two. I don't think the game's done there. And, you could either go that way or that way, and we went under. So, yeah. Three 0 at half time. Was there much of a uh, a feeling that you could pull things around at all? Well, we had chances. I think in the first half, one or two chances to score. Um, I don't know if it was Callum or Hadji. I'm not naming names, but there was a chance. I can't remember. It fell to, and 
maybe if we scored that, it's a different story. But yeah, you can't look at that and say it would have been a different game. But yeah, we we tried to get back into the game, but yeah, we weren't at it. Yeah, didn't help the fact that Tats had to go off as well. Looked a, a pretty severe injury. Yeah, he's done his back. Obviously, he went out for the header and yeah, hurt himself. And obviously, it's another big loss. Um, another loss we can't really afford because there's too many players out and. Yeah, it becomes difficult. Mm. Just the one change by the manager at half time, but I guess he, you, you couldn't have really um, held it against him if he'd made more than the one change. No, yeah, like you say, Jay come off, but yeah, it could have been any one of us. None of us were at our level, and yeah, he could have made any change. Mm. So Preston leapfrog you in the table, but you are still eighth, and going into the weekend, you are still just three points off that top six. Yeah, obviously. Now it hurts and it's disappointing, but we've got to learn from this and we've got to look forward because, like you say, it's only three points and it's another game where, yeah, we weren't at and we've got to look at it. We can't look over the fact that we weren't good enough today, but, yeah, like you say, it's three points and 12 games to go, I think it is, so, yeah, we're still in it.